Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name's David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we are gonna look at Realme from Jeff Copeland and Copeland Coins. All right, Realme, what is this? This is, well, it's coin magic. It's coin magic, it's money magic. I'm doing coin magic and money magic all week long. All week long, reviews on coin magic and money magic. Uh, this is a five routine set, okay? It's five routines, five coin routines, and five other slights and moves that all uh, use the edge grip. Now, I previously reviewed Treasure. Uh, I said it was more aimed at the beginner and those people who are just starting out. Realme, on the other hand, I think is more of a challenge. I think this is more aimed at the intermediate to advanced coin magician. It does teach the edge grip very well, but the routines I think are gonna be a little bit more angle sensitive. You're gonna have to pay more attention to your environment and your spectators. And I think just the overall moves are gonna be a little bit more on the advanced side. All right, so a couple questions we always ask about all of our magic reviews, and the first of which is, What's in the box? What's in the box? You're getting a card stock, like a really thick four ply, eight ply, 16 ply, I don't know, it's really super thick, uh, gold edged cardstock folder. Uh, the top flap of the folder has the password and login. And then the bottom half has two really beautiful kingdom coins. Now the kingdom coins have a medieval theme to them that is uh, reminiscent of the geography and the time period. They're a bronze gray color and they kind of look the same as the previous coins, but they're not. The Tresser coins are more of an orange copper, and these are more of a bronze gray. And so uh, again, like the previous set, one is more the size of a half dollar, and the other one is more the size of a dollar coin. Now, these coins are a little different than the Tresser coins. There's some interesting features to these that I would like to point out to you. Number one, these coins have a hole in the center, the shape of a Maltese cross. Now, some people who do coin work uh, have used the Chinese coins that have circles cut out of the center. Uh, and, and those are cool and they're interesting to look at. And those are usually uh, an orange or a copper color as well. These have a cross cut out of the center. So that's pretty cool. And they're kind of more of a British kind of Englandy looking coin. The second cool feature about these coins, besides the fact that they are edge milled, they are edge milled like the previous set, these coins are magnetically attractive. These coins are magnetic, which means you can use these with some of your favorite vanishing devices that utilize a magnet. That is really super cool. And yes, you do get the bronze coins with this. However, you will need silver coins to do several of these effects. All right, so what about the video? How is the teaching instruction? Uh, the video itself is roughly an hour and 43 minutes long. And Jeff does give you the option to download it to your desktop or your cell phone. But I don't know why you would wanna do that because this utilizes a brand new teaching technology that Jeff calls Dave, D-A-V-E. And what it is, you go to the website, you type in your password, and then you get access to uh, the video. The video floats in the middle of your frame. Down at the bottom, you've got a menu. It's totally navigatable. You can see uh, different pages as well as the titles of all the slights and tricks. And then the sides of the frame have bonus features. So you're gonna get the same trick or move, but from a different angle. You're gonna get extensive notes. You're gonna get uh, books and credits where these uh, slides originally appeared. You're gonna get mouse overs, rollovers. The entire teaching instruction is interactive. It's interactive and way more immersive than any other coin instruction or magic instruction I have ever seen. All right, so how are the routines? What are the routines you're gonna get on this? Like I said, you're getting five routines. Uh, the first one is a uh, one-handed triple where the coins change colors and you're gonna show both sides of the coin every single time so there's no deception. A silver coin uh, changes to bronze and then to copper and then back to silver and then it vanishes and you can do it all in one hand. He's gonna have a bonus uh, four coin change in there uh, as well. Second trick is called Transpedo. It's a three phase routine where a bronze and silver coin change places and each time the transposition gets more wonderful and then the last change happens right in your spectator's hand. Third trick is called Downston Production. It's a super clean four coin production. It's all done with sleight of hand, no sleeves, no gimmicks, just four coins. The next trick is called C4PO. It's a four coin traveling pocket routine. 
And every single time you do the travel, it's done in a different way, leaving the last time to be super impossible. And then the last trick is called Radio Man Dollars. What you have is four coins, one at a time, they vanish and come back in a super cool way. This is a super clean David Roth style hanging coins routine that you can do with sleeves up and bare hands. And like I said, these tricks and slights are more aimed at the intermediate to advanced magicians. If I were you, I would start with Tresser and move your way up to Realme. And you know, I don't give out ratings. I don't do four star, five star, nine out of 10. Uh, I don't do gem of the week or anything like that. Uh, I try to kind of leave that up to you because I want you to make your own opinion because I don't know what kind of stuff you like. But I will say this is some of the best coin instruction or magic instruction I have ever seen from a producer. Jeff Copeland really cares about his product and he really cares about you as a consumer and you can see that come across both in his coins and in his teaching style. And what that is gonna end up doing is making you a better coin magician and a better performer. So if you've watched my channel for any amount of time, you know I'm not really big on coin magic or money magic. That's what makes this week so special. So I had to go out and get some help and I wanna thank Jonathan Todd and all the people down at Magic Cafe who've reviewed these. Uh, thank you for your notes and for allowing me to uh, share some of that so that I could present the best possible review for you. Uh, Jonathan Todd uh, knows his way around coins. He's been around coin magic for a while and Jeff Copeland's work and so uh, I want to thank him for helping me out with this review. Well, that's pretty much everything I can say about Realme from Copeland Coins. Of course, if you would like to purchase this for yourself, you can head on down to hocus-pocus.com. I want to thank Hocus Pocus for allowing me to have this so that I can do the review for you. And if you would like to purchase this or any other cool magic effects, head on down there. They would love to be your number one shop for magic supplies on the internet. Thanks. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.